Uncut, Uncensored Truth Radio on ISBC Truth Channel. On ISBC Truth Channel. The only place you want to come to for the truth, the unadulterated truth, right here on ISBC Truth. With your host, Pastor Michael Smith, and co-host... Sister Smith, baby. Sister Smith, baby. Ain't it easy for cheesy? Ah. Uh. Don't forget, if you want to subscribe to this channel, if you just come across, come across this channel, that's your first time here, stay a while. All you have to do is simply hit that subscribe button. Next to that subscribe button, it's a bell. Hit that bell so you can be notified when we drop this breaking news on you. Next to that, there is a like button. Make sure we stay lit by just simply hitting that like button. Oh, let's go ahead and hear this. Sister Smith? Okay. Raleigh man charged with murder... And woman's death on Christmas night, police. Damn, not Christmas night. Yeah. Nah, it could have been, you know, it could have been Easter. Not Christmas <laughs> night. <laughs> Why did he have to do this on Christmas night, people? Why? You know what I'm saying? What, he didn't get him, he didn't get the present that he wanted? Right. <laughs> did, 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 did the woman, was the woman bothering him? Oh, you can't get me a present? Why did he do this on Christmas night? No, well, no, well. The man just killed a woman on Christmas. <laughs> <laughs> not Christmas night. He looked black too, sisters, man. He looks black. You know, you know what I'm saying? Light, a light skinned black, but he's a black one. Yeah. <laughs> Go ahead. Okay. A fifty-year-old. Oh no, man. he ain't. No, 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 no. You know, I thought this was gonna be a young boy. No. Nope. No, this man ain't fifty years old. He's too damn old <laughs> to be going to jail. Yeah. Anyway, you know what I'm saying? That old people don't think. I mean, these old people don't think. You would think that he would think before he reacted to certain things. Like you said, they think they can't, they're, in, uh, they're untouchable. Yeah, they're in la-la world. That's what it is. Yeah. <laughs> they're in la-la world. You know what they call Walmart, you know what I'm saying, the mega Walmart? What do they call the mega Walmarts down in Georgia, Sister Smith? I don't, I don't know. They call it Wally's World. Really? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. The Super Walmart's down in Georgia. They call it Wally's World because it stay open 24 hours a day. Uh-huh. Yeah, yeah. So <laughs> 3 o'clock in the morning. You know what I'm saying? They say, I'm going to Wally's World. Yeah, that's what they call uh -huh. it. You know what I'm saying? That's what this 50 year old man. He's in, he was in Wally's World right now. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. He was in the world in itself to think that you can just kill somebody. And not get charged with the murder. What you thought? You were just going to go ahead and, you know what I'm saying, drink your tea in the morning after you done kill somebody? It don't uh, work yeah, that way. I did think that. Oh. You know what I'm saying? Hey, listen. Drugs is bad. Drugs is bad. You know what I'm saying? When you're taking drugs, you, 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 your, your thinking is not on fleek. Your mm -hmm. thinking is being uh, derailed. Mm-hmm. But go ahead. A 50-year-old Raleigh man has been charged with murder in a Christmas night death, according to the Raleigh Police Department. Police were called around 10.50 p.m. on Christmas to a Raleigh Extended State America motel. Not a, not a motel. Mm -hmm. Not a motel. Yep. Lord, Lord, Lord. And you know what the sad thing about this is, Sister Smith? What? It probably was a woman's motel. Mm-mm-mm. <laughs> Go ahead. Uh, the, uh, it was at 3531 Wake Forest Road to assist the Raleigh Fire Department. Fire department. Yeah, fire department. What the I'm hell saying. happened? Somebody, you know what I'm saying, left a hot crack pipe on the damn covers and burnt up the whole room? 
Oh, uh, <laughs> let me see. <laughs> wow. Somebody was smoking crack. <laughs> Somebody done dropped that damn hot pipe. Right. <laughs> yeah. Go go ahead. The incident was first reported as a hostage situation around eight forty-five p.m. at thirty-five thirty-one Wake Forest Road, which is. The location of an extended stay, America. Yep, that sounds like that sounds like two individuals smoking crack. One got paranoid and tried to open the door, and the other one said, "Don't open that door. Somebody out there." Mm -hmm. Hold on. Ch -ch -ch. You hear that? You hear that noise? No, yep. baby, I don't hear no noise. Hold up. Shut up. Turn that TV down. <laughs> Somebody's out there. Don't close that curtain. You hear that noise? No. No, baby, I don't hear no noise. I got to use the bathroom. <laughs> flush. What's that noise? I just flushed the toilet. No, it wasn't. You flushed them right down the toilet. Who you had in here? <laughs> <laughs> Sound like a bunch of crack crackheads in this wow. hotel. That's what it sounds like to me. Go, go ahead. An adult female has been transported to the hospital with serious serious injuries. No burn Ronnie marks? Huh? No burn marks? Ain't said yet. Okay. Cause you know Rick you know Rick James was arrested for burning his girlfriend with a crack pipe. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Okay. Raleigh police said in a short statement around 10.50 p.m., a man was taken to, into custody at the scene, according to police. Officer and uh, investigators are currently on the scene determining the circumstances surrounding this incident. Open the shut case. It was a, it was, it was a case of Two individuals smoking crack, and one got paranoid and killed the other. <laughs> um, <laughs> yeah. That's open and shut case. Open and shut case. You know what I'm saying? The okay. red flag went up is when they was both in an extended state motel. That's red flag number one. You know what huh. I'm saying? Red flag number two is what else could they be arguing over? <laughs> Pure paranoia. Yeah. Somebody opened up that curtain. <laughs> That's what happened. Somebody opened up that curtain. I've been around too many crackheads not to know the symptoms of crackish stuff. <laughs> I know. I know. I know what looks crackish when I see crackish. I do. I sure enough do. I've been around too many not to know. Go ahead. Scissor Smith? Yeah. Go ahead. Okay. Officers and investigators are currently on the scene determining the uh, circumstances surrounding this incident. The police statement said, police said there was no ongoing threats to the public. Um, um, it looked like that's it. Mm hmm. I told you. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. I bet you what the police ain't telling you is they found a loaded stem on the counter. <laughs> on the where? <laughs> on the dresser. <laughs> <laughs> a loaded stem right there on the dresser. A couple of pushers laying around. You know what I'm saying? A couple of nine working big lighters. <laughs> <laughs> Lord, Lord. <laughs> a couple of nine working big lighters and you know what I'm saying and uh I guess that I guess that's it. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> that's what this is. It's got to be. Hey, there is no other way. <laughs> mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? And the next day I bet you he won't wait, well, he gonna be he's locked up for a long time because he didn't kill 
his crack buddy. That's his crack buddy. That's the, the woman was his crack buddy. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. You know, and that's what they do. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? At night, they sit and they chill and they smoke crack together. You know what I'm saying? They get their crumbs. They start pushing that damn stem. Pushing that stem. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> yeah. Lord, okay, that's going to wrap that up. You know what I'm saying? One well, thank you all for tuning in and logging on to another edition of ISB. Oh, you don't say his name, do it. Uh, it don't say his name. What? So far, no. Okay. Want well, to thank you all for tuning in, logging on to another edition of ISBC Truth Channel right here on ISBC Truth with your host, Pastor Michael Smith, and co-host Sister Smith, baby. Sister Smith, baby. There she goes doing that damn late talk again. You know what I'm saying? Okay, and, okay. Yeah, uh, and, and co-host. Sister Smith, baby. There she go. There she go. Now she's cooking with Crisco. All right. And if you're new to this channel, you uh, want to subscribe to this channel, if this is the first time here, hit that subscribe button. Next to that subscribe button, there's a bell. Hit that bell so you'll be notified when we drop this breaking news on you. And on the other hand, there was a like button. Make sure you guys hit that like button so we can stay lit over here. Till next uh -huh. time. On to the next.